Welcome back. I'm Tyler, you're watching Scarfing Scarves, and welcome to another edition of I Take Some Shit Out of the Box. Because honestly, I'm kind of on a mission at this point. The last thing I unboxed, which was not on camera, was Toys Museum, and it was a huge fucking disappointment that I'm really fucking angry about, and I'm gonna make a whole video about. There were some issues. So this time, for the festive season, we are unboxing Lovely Poodle, and for the same reason we are not in my room, we are out here amongst the Christmas decor so that I may wear British Bear in its natural environment. And also there's a bear on my head. So that's what's going and what, on. And what, what sound does the bear make, Tyler? When the bear pops out of your head, as is known, it goes wow. <laughs> like a little mushroom. It's a little bear shroom. That's what's going on. And I put them on my head because I'm wearing British Bear, and I thought it would be really cute to put a little bear on my head. That's in a different video. You can see the making of this cord in A Man vs. Kawaii, which really went off the rails pretty obviously. Pretty pretty fast, too. Pretty fast, too. I mean, most of the work was done for you, all right? Yeah, that's true. So we had to make ends meet, <laughs> and we did. Yep. So let's get right to it. Let's unbox Lovely Poodle and see if it also disappoints me. I put in a reservation for this dress forever ago, so this wasn't like, oh, I saw the stock photos and had to have it. This was a, I saw the fabric swatch and had to have it. And we'll see if it lives up to the hype, because AP is known to change things after they show you pictures of it. So we'll see. I'm getting this open now. <gasps> is that a calendar? <laughs> ah! I didn't expect there to be a calendar. What's no, the note say? I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm gonna respect their privacy because I don't know if they want me to mention them on camera. Oh, but okay. I just want to thank my shopping service so much. You're always fantastic. Seriously, like I, I would not have been able to get through 2020 with any kind of brand or shit to look forward to without your services. Thank you so much. I don't want to mention them because I don't know if they want to be associated with me. Also, they're really fucking busy, so I don't know if they want more business at this point. So that might that might not be good for them. But thank you, seriously. You know who you are. And I guess we should unbox the dress now that I freaked out about the calendar. <laughs> Look at it! Look at it! It's the 2021 calendar! It's got their new bunnies on it! New bunnies never seen before by AP. Brand new bunnies, everybody. Brand new bunnies! I'm really excited. I can't I cannot wait. I love these desk calendars and I haven't had one for a few years. Is my bear falling off my head? He Your bear like... is fine. All right, good. He feels like he's trying to like jump ship. All right, let's take this out. It's got their new, their new tag. Notice that AP has changed their tags. I like their old tags better, but maybe I just don't like change. <laughs> All right, let's see. Is this gonna disappoint me? If you could do me the favor. No. <laughs> what do you want? Before I open this any further, <laughs> can you fetch me a white? Anger, please. White. Anger. Go into my closet if you want to grab one for sure. Yeah, I don't think we have any anymore. Here we go. We're walking through Tyler's room. We're getting the white hanger. There's my reflection, which she needs to edit out. Doop 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 doo. -doo, 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 -doo. There's a the closet. There's a white hanger. Doop doop doo. -doo, -doo. distinct impression that there was singing involved. <laughs> I apologize for nothing. I'm going to beat you with this. I won't do the job. That's a good point. I need to get more creative with my murder implements. <sighs> One day you're going to be taking a bath and I'm just going to shove the entire Christmas tree in there. That would be a neat trick. It would be. It would involve a power cord, a lot of pumping, <laughs> some dragging noises. You would have to have pretty loud music on not to hear it coming. I think a toaster would be easier. Yeah, but who has a toaster available in the bathroom? As opposed to a Christmas tree? Festive. <laughs> anyway, let's continue. 
you. Let's actually do the thing they came here for. This is Angelic Pretty's Lovely Poodle, and I'm already, I'm already digging it. I heralded this as the heir apparent to Milky Planet style, and I think that's holding true so far, because I am seeing quite a few lovely poodles already. Look at that right there. Look at that baby. Milky Planet also has like, not Milky Planet, Milky Chan the Fawn. <laughs> also, did I say Milky Planet earlier too? I don't remember. If I did, I was talking about Milky Chan the Fawn. This is the aesthetic heir apparent to Milky Chan the Fawn, and I feel like that holds true still. It's not the same level, obviously. It's not the same dress, but I, I just felt too many similarities were there to ignore it. Like, Milky Chan also has a really cute lamp in the print, and here's a little poodle lamp. Look at that. Look at the little poodle lamp. And there's a little for you, little letter there that matches the necklaces that APU released for this series. I wasn't wild about it, but it did remind me of Romantic Rose Letter. Oh, I love this bodice. Wow. I honestly was not thrilled about the images I was seeing of Lovely Poodle in the shop photos. Like, I was not thrilled by that, but honestly, this is looking really cute. Oh, I forgot that I got the head bow. I was like, what is no. that? Ah. All right, let's get a hanger on it. Ow. Sorry, I just assaulted the cameraman. <laughs> That's what I think of you. Get out of here. <laughs> you poor man. All right. These are the slots so they don't go anywhere. Abuse. Abuse. I can't really like, I can't like, you know, hold it out like I usually do. I might stand up in a second so you can uh, actually you see You wanna stand up? It. Sure, let's yeah. do it. Cameraman's gonna help me up. Cause I'm a gentleman, goddammit. A gentleman. Ugh, that would imply you were human. Ugh. I was obviously sitting up. I should have let go as you were getting up. You totally should have, but I would have taken out the tree on my way down. Anyway. Let me put down the head bow. I'm just like already. It's already hanging on to it. Like mine. Lovely Poodle by Angelic Pretty. And honestly, I am really, really glad that I bought this. I was not impressed with the photos they were putting out. AP's already released a lot of photos of this. And I was just like, eh. They looked weirdly dark. And this purple ribbon looked really dark too. But honestly, in person, it's a lot lighter than I thought it would be. I was expecting a really dark purple, like royal purple. Like, but it turned out really well. I kind of want to look at it too. Wow. This is really, really fucking cute. It's probably going to be a little bit hard to coordinate because it is a deeper kind of dustier pink than I was expecting from the fabric sample. And I'll put the fabric sample on screen so you can compare what you're looking at right now to the fabric sample. I almost think that they decided on the last minute to like go with a different color. But I think it's really cute. Look at the little baby. Look at his little face. Isn't he cute? He's blapping too. He is totally blapping! And the thing is, it seems to be the baby of like each poodle. See, there's a pink poodle and a purple poodle. Mm -hmm. I think yeah. this is like the dad poodle. Who also is, has his tongue hanging He's out. He's got his little tongue out. And you'll notice like the babies of each have like colors in common. Let me see if there's one, if there's another one. There's pink and purple. Ah, white. Yeah. White. There you go. There's a white poodle. I think that one's childless or child yeah, well, free, if you will. That's a lamp. Oh, yeah, maybe he's, uh... Unless it's been fucking the lamp! <laughs> oh, I was gonna say maybe he's taxidermied. <laughs> Horrible! <laughs> Awful! Not cute at all! <laughs> taxidermied poodle! <laughs> no, I think it turned out really cute! This is a cute-ass dress! I love the teacup. Do you see the teacups? Uh, apparently not. Where are the teacups? The teacups, like, it's right under the lamp. Wherever your taxidermy poodle is, it's right okay. next to it. Oh, yeah, there's a teacup right there. Got a little teacup. The poodle has little ribbons in their hair. I yep. love their their weird stuffed animal eyelashes. Are you seeing the uh, the purple poodle's eyelashes? They're like pink. Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah. Why doesn't the white poodle have any babies? Like, I hate children, like, outright. But, like, <laughs> I like dog children and cat children. Just gonna let that sit there. Dog children and cat children. <laughs> 
technical names, not, all not right? Not puppies and kittens. They're like dog children and cat children. Puppies and kittens. That's stupid. <laughs> They're dog children and cat children. I mean, that's technically true, I suppose. As God intended. They yeah. certainly biblically knew each to other say. to make that baby, all right? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Meanwhile, the lonely little white poodle sits with her lamp. <laughs> God, she's like the one from uh, It's a Wonderful Life, where she's she's just like, she's, oh, what was it? Spinster? What was it? Oh, yeah. The, the like, his wife in, in the alternate version where he was never born. Everyone's life is terrible, and the worst of all is his wife because she's 30 years old and she's not married and she works at the library. That's like the the cruelest fate imaginable. She has glasses, like, Tyler. Yeah, like, you're, you're not going to like it. She's an old maid. <laughs> the horrible, horrible, awful ending is she's not married before 30. Oh, God. Whatever will she do? <clears throat> this bear is trying to... And the way he... I love the way he he runs around like a crazy person. He never figures out, like, yes, dude... Like, you don't exist in this universe. He's still running around. The way he goes up to this woman he's never met before, he goes, Mary, don't you know me? It's me, George Bailey. And then she goes, <laughs> It's a Wonderful Life starring Tyler Willis and Cameraman. And she's just looking at him like, and she doesn't even fucking say. He's anything. got like the bug eyes and the five o'clock shadow. I'm like serious. he looks like he just bur broke out of the fucking funny farm. <laughs> funny farm is not good enough. And she doesn't even say anything to him. Like no, bozo, I don't know who you are. Go take a shower, get sober. But like. It's so, it's so weird. It's such a weird turn. And that's the worst thing that could happen to her is that she's not married by 30. Oh. She's an old maid. All right, then. I'm going to go take a shower. Your money's in Bill's house and, <laughs> and Fred's house. That's my Jimmy Stewart, by the way. It's actually pretty good. <laughs> I'm honestly kind of impressed. Jimmy Stewart's fun to imitate. He's just have a fun voice. He talks in his back molars. That's where his voice is. He's like, he has a Says everything <laughs> like this. Every, every single thing. It's very recognizable. <laughs> he is the perfect example of, if you can't think of anything else, do a funny voice. <laughs> Except for, that's his voice. <laughs> Unlike Gilbert Gottfried. Uh, yeah, we're not going to go there. You don't have a Gilbert Gottfried for the good people at home? Do you want to hear my Gilbert Gottfried? Do we not want to hear Do you Gilbert Gottfried as George Bailey? I'm Mary! <laughs> Mary! <laughs> don't you know me? <laughs> <laughs> It's me, Iago from Aladdin. <laughs> All of that staying in, just so you know. This bear feels like it's about to come off my goddamn head. He is, he's exiting stage. What the hell happened here. to this video? He's trying to come off. He's gonna fall the fuck off and just like he, he doesn't even want to be here for whatever this video is. He's fucking committing Sudoku. Stole that from Stevie. Stole that from Stevie. I think I've got him on now. I think he's good. I think he's gonna stay on. Just... What's the noise he makes when he falls off my head? Ah! The Wilhelm scream. That's what he needs. You need to cue in the Wilhelm scream. <laughs> I really feel like this bear is about to come off. Maybe I should put him in front next time. Anyway, lovely poodle. Oh yeah, that's Merry right. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I can't open any of my Christmas presents for you guys because you know Christmases are like they're private, and that would be kind of weird. So like. So I figured we'd do an unboxing out here instead, so you could see a thing get opened that this close it up. Yeah. A lovely poodle. There you go. I think lovely we, poodle. I think we've covered lovely poodle enough. I think they'll get enough of an idea of lovely poodle. I like that it has subtle. I like that it has subtle polka dots. I think that's really cute. It's got these little bitty <laughs> ones. I think it's got poodle shapes on it too. Doesn't it have like poodle shapes? It doesn't. I thought it did. What are you laughing about? I'm still laughing about the fucking... Still stuck on the bed? <laughs> the, 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 the fucking Gilbert Gottfried as George Bailey is laughing at. A poodle oh, there shape. You go. Look at poodle that. Shape. It's there got you go. poodle dots. All right. Poodle dots. Poodle dots. This bear is coming the fuck off my head. Yep. There you go. Yeah. It just... It keeps... Hang on. I think we're okay. 
Now I just don't move <laughs> at all. This is how the rest of the video is going. <laughs> I'm gonna have to pin him onto my head. Like seriously, he's trying to slide off. There's a reason you don't wear two fucking headbands at once without a wig. But yeah, I think it's cute. I think it came out really well. I love all the poodles. I love the pillows. What else is there to say? I like the angelic pretty thingy. I think we're gonna wrap it. I think we're good. I like this dress. This dress made up for the fucking dumpster fire <laughs> in the Toys Museum. I'm holding this bear onto my head at this point. Like, we're just gonna hold him or he's gonna jump. We gotta jump around. Do a flip! He might! He might! <laughs> so yeah, lovely poodle! Look at that! Bruce bear jumps off my head. I can feel him moving again! Oh! <laughs> this is going poorly! Um, oh, and I got the head bow. Look at that. It's the head bow. It's cute. Cute. I, I'm probably going to adjust it because I don't like those head bows that lay flat on your head like that. I think they look weird. So I'm probably going to snip the strings and readjust it. I did that for Jewel Marine's head bow. It originally laid flat and it looks really fucking weird. It's just like, Wah. no one likes that. That's not cute. What, so. what sound does it make? What? All right then. Bear is trying to escape my skull. <laughs> I can feel him moving. <laughs> it's very unnerving. Do I need to play the wrap it up music? <laughs> you do! You do! Alright, so this has been Tyler. You've been watching Scarving Scarves. This was a cluster fuck at this point, but not a cluster frock. This is a very simple frock for Angelic Pretty, don't you think? For Angelic Pretty standards, yeah, yeah, it's pretty minimalist. And before we go, please note the poodle lace. Poodle lace, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, there you go, poodle lace. Boom. Ye old. Poodle Lace. Doggo Laceo. Let's endo the video. <laughs> Since uh, it's probably your last Christmas video, you want me to hand oh, me that yeah. and just get one last look of a... At our Christmas decor? Yeah. Let me put things Milk this shit for everything it's worth. Ah, the milkers. I don't want to say your name. If they get a boatload of traffic from me, they'll probably be really mad. They're like, they're already super busy. If I send any more people this way, their way, they might kill me. <laughs> All right. Got it. All right. It's moving. Be quick about it. Uh, th there you go. In all seriousness, even though I can feel this bear slowly creeping off the back of my head. Merry Christmas. One last look at our Christmas decor in our Christmas house that we decorated even though we can't have our nice Christmas party for people to see it. We decorated because we love this holiday and it means the world to us. We look forward to it every year and we're glad that you guys could join us in our Christmas Wonderland for the first time. We've never gotten to show anyone everything. And again, if you want to see everything in our Christmas decor, we did a whole Christmas decor house tour including the bathroom in another video called Christmas Decor Tour 2020. Other than that, I think we're good, right? We got got everything. Can we do our outro? Yeah, I think so. All right. Well, this has been Tyler. You've been watching Scarfing Scarves. She's I about to fall over. Our tree. Uh, I've been dipping into the eggnog. <laughs> uh, I'd like to thank my patrons for making this whole shebang. I don't know what it was at this point. Possible. It was supposed to be an unboxing, but it became unbearable. <laughs> and should you like to join their number, you can head over to patreon.com slash lastweeklolitanews for more content that no one should see ever for any reason. Thanks again, guys, and I'll catch you next time. Also, also Merry Christmas. Yes! Boom. Merry Christmas. <laughs>